Hello guys and welcome to Koh Tao Island, the best destination for snorkeling in Thailand. And we are here to check out if it's worth visiting in the most rain season, which is the monsoon season in September. Also, I'm gonna show you where you should stay and how to get here. You're watching Genix Travel Vlogs, let's go. So uh, basically there are two ways to get uh, from Bangkok to Koh Tao. There's a flight to Chumpon and then a ferry or a flight to Koh Samoy and then a ferry. They are basically the same price but getting through Chumpon is takes a bit, little bit less time. So we took the earliest flight at 7.30 in the morning. It was about half the price of the other flight so we chose this one. Club. Guys, we finally made it to Koh Tao. Welcome to Beach Club Hotel. In the west part of the island, there was very stormy, very high winds. But uh, here on the east side, we got a very calm lagoon, beautiful turkey's water. Even the sun is coming out from the clouds. Very beautiful here. This bay is called Shark Bay. And uh, yes, you guessed it right, you can find sharks and turtles in here. You'll be definitely snorkeling over here. Good morning guys, today it's our first full day here in Koh Tao. Today we are going to the most famous place in the island. It's called Koh Nang Yang. It's a private island with a great uh, view spot and uh, a great uh, snorkeling location with, which is called Japanese Garden. Now to get there we got two options. Our hotel located in the southeast of the island. So we either can take a taxi ride there which will cost us 2,500 baht there and back or we can uh, take a taxi which will cost more cheaper to Mahat Pier and there we can uh, take another ride for a much less price. A taxi from our hotel to the Mahat Pier cost us 300 uh, baht and now we found a long tail boat to Koh Nang Island for 200 baht each. We arrived to the island a little bit late. It's one o'clock, the island uh, closes at four. So we had three hours to hike to the viewpoint and then snorkel here at the Japanese garden. We paid 250 baht for each to enter the island because it's a private island. That's a straight uphill, a lot of stairs, no mercy at all. <laughs> well, we can't prepare because it's gonna be tough. here for a long time making photos there was a little a lot of people uh, making uh, photos here so a, a rain just started so we going downstairs who says that they going to Thailand and the monsoon season is not fun <laughs> you got sunshine and then a minute after that you got a heavy rain you should check out this uh, island. Now we are going back to the mainland of Koh Tao. Another great activity here in Koh Tao is going to Shark Island. Shark Island located uh, just one and a half kilometer from uh, our hotel from Shark Bay. It's called like this because it looks like a shark fin coming out from the water and uh, it will cost us 1000 uh, baht for uh, both direction for both of us. We got another spot which is called the uh, Aulak Beach. It's also a snorkeling place. Maybe we'll see some sharks. So we've been in uh, two stations. One was a uh, Shark Island, and the second one was a uh, Kolak Beach. And Kolak, we've seen a lot of uh, baby sharks. What that was uh, very cool, uh, but in uh, Shark Island, nothing special. 
a lot of deep waters but a lot of fish uh, from my opinion you can pass the shark island and go straight to Kolak after three days in Koh Tao, now we're leaving to Koh Phangan and now is the time for the biggest question of them all should you visit Thailand in the rainy season which is the monsoon season in September well when you look at the weather forecast you'll probably see that there's a rain every day but uh, what's really happening is that the rain are mostly coming in the evening and uh, most of the day is shiny so you can travel uh, freely in the island with that said the weather in uh, Thailand can be unpredictable and sometimes you will have rain of 5 or 10 minutes in the middle of the day so yes you definitely should visit at the monsoon season if you love this video hit the like button subscribe and i'll see you in the next video in Kopangan. bye